today what I'll show you how um, um, I'll show you how to make this turn this cube into a chair okay simple chair after that yeah let's see guys get the uh, first edit mode you need to be in edit mode in order to change this object to something otherwise you cannot change you cannot um, think I choose face you see the first one is uh, vertex age and this one is face so click on the face uh, choose um, click on the face and grab it place press G and then if you uh, press Z Z it will uh, change along X Z axis okay along Z axis Z axis is like Z axis is like we have X Y Z axis do you guys know X is in mess you have learned look uh, one side this wall this this wall is X axis the other wall up and down that is called z axis okay so everything we have in the world is three dimensional okay so that is z axis click it now i think the thickness of the menu um uh, make it like zoom in zoom in and zoom out scroll mouse button which is in the middle um the middle mouse button if you click and hold it so you can see from a different uh, perspective okay now as you can see this cube is below the surface okay I'm going to uh, object mode, press grab, and then see along Z axis. I'm going to move it upward. Okay, so that is um, what I have moved. Now I think it's a lot. Um, it is. If you're not sure, check here. You're almost on the surface, right? If you want to move a little bit more, grab, press G, and then Z. So you don't move left and right. Just move upward. Okay, that is done. Now I'm going to. What do we need for chairs? We need four legs and then we need the back part, right? So go to edit mode first because you are changing this. Come here, choose the loop cut. When I do click on this loop cut, come here. Um, you see the cut when I uh, move my cursor, you can see a yellow line. That means you're gonna cut that part, but I don't want to cut in the middle, just click and move it, right? the right side bring it back here move it to the left side see right now I want to cut one cut on this side because um sorry one here one there that's okay so bring and check where is the loop cut now move it okay bring and move your cursor and see you can see the red line move it done see it's, it's cut from the top and bottom now I'm going back to uh, select more uh, thing like this arrow when you select it go to the face select one face okay, just, select face right now I'm going to extrude extrude means um, there is extrude here but you can press E directly in extrude okay so uh, G and grab it along Z axis extrude leg so right surface uh, uh, extrude okay uh, so that is a mistake now if you guys move this yeah this side is thicker doesn't matter that's okay just you guys need to fix it okay now the other one Now I'll stop here because I don't want to make it.